Okay, we're going to go in 3, 2, and I have no idea what, why I start counting. Welcome back, guys, to the White Cannon Tournament preparation. Uh, this is, of course, back. Um, and we've had... Did we have any progress at all over the time that yeah. I was gone? Yes. 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 Okay, good, because I I'd like to, I was going <laughs> to say that a lot has been done, but I really don't remember what's been done and what hasn't, so all I know is that I blew up stuff, so. Okay, I am so hurt. Today we <laughs> will be settling stuff, because we're planning on releasing the map after we finish tonight. So that this is basically going to be finalization stuff so that we can let you guys play around with the map, too. Uh, first thing, um, we did settle on some names. Uh, go, honey. If you want to go ahead and say the names, because since uh, this this is that you were like prodding me forever to get this done, right? So go ahead. <clears throat> there may have been a little gentle prodding, yes, forever. Okay, so the house challenge, which you can see the house right here, where you have to remember to make a cannon to destroy. So this is the accuracy you want to hit the house. We've decided to be called accuracy, the destruction challenge. Deconstruction. So, deconstruction. Decon D deconstruction. The deconstruction challenge, yes. Yeah, because the construction just came out together. So accuracy, the deconstruction challenge. That's what's going to be yep. your uh, name for the house. Now t the tonight we will be altering this look a little bit too, but that's beside the point. Yeah. Just want to make sure that uh, you guys don't think that's exactly what's going to look like when we're finished. So all right, keep going. The next challenge that we have a name for is right here. Well. I guess might as well just be right here. We have the Uber Sheep, which we've jacked up and made them awesome sauce good with uh, Seth Bling and Pack. And this one is the distance, I'm sorry, precision for the Uber Sheep, and that is precision Uber Sheep landing. So that's that challenge. Yep. And then on the same lane, you see all the sand over here already. This one is your distance challenge, and that is going to be Acme Anvil Antics, the triple A challenge. And that is to get an anvil, ignore the sand, we were, we were testing, testing. Get an <laughs> anvil as far down the line as you can. And you know, we have to test to know that you guys can do this, so. We, we, we were, the reason there's sand is because we were unsure if sand and anvils fly the same distance. Um, honestly, I it, we didn't we weren't able to test it enough. I just found a video of somebody launching it like five thousand blocks or something like that. So I think that that's pretty accurate. We can depend on you guys to be able to do that. If you can't do that, oh, yeah. well, you'd better figure out how to do that pretty quick because you're going to be firing an anvil. Um, so that's basically what we've done for name stuffs, and I will be giving off the we will be deciding on the actual date tonight too. I do have some in mind. I'm thinking probably in about three weeks on the weekend is probably going to be when I say that the actual thing is going to start. Why is... Hmm. I gotta fix that. But anyway, okay, so what else are we doing right now? We were just about to go play with the house if I, if I remember correctly. Yes. Um, <laughs> okay, the first thing that we gotta do is we need to get rid of... Um, <laughs> We need to get rid of all this grass. Uh, the pr reason we got to get rid of the grass is because the grass can be um, counted as a block, which is not good. So we can't have that grass here. And be I, I can't help but think of your pondry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Which one? I'm oh, the, the last, last one. one. Oh, yeah, the yes. last one. <laughs> that yes. was a good one. Oh, uh, Link Reader. I'm like, mm, mm. Okay. You didn't watch. Do we have to get rid of the mushrooms and the and the flowers too? Are well, they the same as the grass? Pretty much. Okay. There's some of it. Uh, now, second what thing is, is I'm looking at these trees, and I'm thinking these trees are too small. Well, the trees were their own issue. So, the trees you specified to have a few fluffy little trees, right? Mm -hmm. uh, or fluffy big trees. And we, we actually made them um, the big ancient gypsy tree stuff, but then it either mushed into the house, mushed into the glass, or it blocked the house view entirely. And so... Well, I think we could just go ahead and plop down trees, like, right here. And somewhere in oh, line I'm with that. Oh, about the bone meal. 
We're, see, now here's the thing. We don't have to do bone meal. We can build the trees. This is Minecraft. Y y yeah. Yeah, you can, so... You can build the trees. This is right. true. Plus, I did want to build them anyways because, um... You're, you're standing where I was going to put that down. Uh, if we, if we, um... Sorry. If we bake them, um, with a bone meal, those leaves will deconstruct. So if we blow up the branches around it, then they'll deconstruct and that'll count as a block that was destroyed. Which it shouldn't, because, um, they didn't do that. Mm -hmm. Did you just break the block I just put? <laughs> Hon? Um... Yes. Yes, All right, I did. We're gonna put that block back down right here. Yes, yes, I did. I apologize. I, <laughs> was, I was gonna move bones. it anyways, but hon. <laughs> okay. Sorry. So that's. I think we're gonna put mm. the trees there. Um, the bush. I don't. I don't know. We could probably leave the bush. What about the little topiaries and the nether wart around the house? Does that have to go too? Well, the nether wart can stay. That's fine. It's uh, about the same dis same difference. But the um the vines will, will they'll blow up way too easily. Okay, so we can get rid of the vines too. Grass and vines, got it. Sorry about your block pack. <laughs> That's fine. Okay, this. <laughs> I didn't even pay attention to it. This tree can go. I don't think we need this one. Okay. Plus, this is a deconstructing tree, isn't it? Before the trees get rid of are, are gotten rid of entirely, I would like to point out how amazingly awesome it was that about midnight when Mihai, you and I were wrapping things up, we bone mealed those and got all four the exact same height. That, that is, was that like is pretty good. Amazing thing. Uh, what were vines. you doing? I got rid of. I uh, was setting up world edit things to get rid of the vines. Oh, okay. That's, oh, that's kind of cool. Did. Didn't know you could do that. All right, these little derpy trees right here, we should probably get rid. Of. I don't know about the lanterns. See, we can leave them, but all they're going to do is possibly block a TNT blast. So, we could do that. It's fine. But um, we can get that would add again. some challenge to it. But it would add some challenge to it. Midnight. <laughs> we were. We actually made ourselves. Miheyu came on, and he was great. He built. Uh, he built. This is his house. Mm -hmm. I only did. I did very little on this house. Miheyu was a rock star. I did even less. Yeah, <laughs> I sent him to bed. But we um, we um, came back. I didn't destroy the block this time. There's a missing block. In oh, wait, you weren't meant to destroy that. I I didn't do that one. Okay, okay, so let's um, take a look at the house. Now, um, as you guys heard with the challenge, this is going to be the, the deconstruction challenge. Um, the idea is that the number of blocks that you destroy counts towards the points at the end of, at the end of the game. So, um, the n each each regular block counts as one point. And the way we're going to do this is we're going to use a copy paste in world edit so that we can count the number of blocks. Because when we paste it, it'll tell us how many blocks are, which just got changed. And that's why I don't want yeah. entities or anything like that because entities won't copy properly. Um, there is one exception where for the outhouse out back because I had to have a moon on top of the outhouse because it looks awesome. Yes. Now, as far as the extra points go, uh, there is going to be a few extra points, and um, in the name of emerald blocks, gold blocks, and diamond blocks. The way I think I figured out I want to do it is I want to make make it so the emerald blocks are going to be worth ten points. Gold blocks are going to be worth 20... Well, let's see. Uh, is it going to be 25 or 50? I'm thinking... I'm thinking 25 points for the gold blocks, and it's going to be 100 points for the diamond blocks. Now, here's the thing. These ones are not going to be them. We're going to put a bed there. So when you get it, there'll be a bed. Um, uh, Pack, you just say 100 for the diamond, yes? Yes, I did. Okay. Um, well, we probably should just take out the fire, too, because the fire is not going to matter. Uh, we'll, we'll leave it in there for now, but during the actual competition, no entities, so no fire. Um, what's in here anyway? Oh, yeah. The, the, so this emerald ore right here does not count because it's not an emerald block. It's just an emerald ore. So just so come you up, guys know. Come up. Come up. Come up. Come up what? There's a ladder. There's a ladder? Secrets. Oh, I haven't even fly. been up here yet. Secrets. I have not even been up here. What? I know. Another... Want other blocks against ceiling or in the floor? Oh, I forgot about that sign I made. Yeah, you can just like to remember if you wanted to stick other blocks up here, you have another location. But again, Mihai, you stuck a lovely little ladder on the side. By the way, this house is actually uh, our best interpretation recreation from a picture that uh, Sir Pack of Rat sent us to choose from. So, well, yeah. Okay, so here's where we're going to put the gold blocks, I'm thinking. 
Um, I'm thinking we should put one underneath. Well, we'll basically distribute the gold blocks in, in a minute. I'm thinking that one is going to go underneath the porch here, one underneath the fireplace, and one underneath uh, whatever is over here. The one underneath the bed. That should be good. Um, that should be that's uh, 75 points well distributed, and there it's behind the house. So we'd have to take out most of the house in order to do that. That's good. Maybe we could put one in the ceiling, in in the in the roof. That'd be fine. Yeah, we'll put we'll put one up there. So I should probably get gold blocks on my bar then. We should, yeah, I was gonna say gold blocks. Ahoy! I got the one underneath the uh, porch. Okay. We'll do. You know where I'm gonna put it? I'm gonna put it um right next to the chest. Uh, do you want to approve the one under the porch? Uh, approve the one under the porch. Let me see you the one under the porch. See it from where I'm at, or from that side if you look under. Is it like dead center? It's yeah, it's roughly middle. Close enough. That's fine. Yeah. And okay, so that's that one. You said one under the uh, outhouse. You said. Uh no, no. I said one underneath the fire. Oh, under the fire. Okay. Well, actually, yeah, no, I, I, I said underneath the fire, underneath the porch, and underneath the bed. And the bed. Right. Are you getting under the fire on? Uh, under the fire. Sure. I got it. Okay, you got oh, it? Okay. I need bricks, too. I don't have any bricks. We'll go with that brick right there. Brick. Okay, so that's another one right there. So now you guys see where that one is. Now, as far as the diamond block goes, the diamond block's actually already placed. The diamond block is in the outhouse. It's a special block. Um, mm -hmm. It is down here, but it's not only down here, but it is surrounded by obsidian. So you would actually have to get a pretty lucky shot on this one. Um, this is like the, your desperation shot right here. If you are that far behind and you need that extra 100 points, then you might want to take some pot shots at this. But um, outside of that, I don't think that this is one you want to be going for because you're not going to get it. You're just not going to get it. Um, or skill shot. Yeah, that, if, you get, if you've got a skill shot where you can land a TNT directly on top of that obsidian uh, die, yeah, go for it. But You um, earned your 100 points. Yeah, you did. Yeah, you definitely did. Now, as far as uh, the emerald goes, here's what I want to do for the emerald. I want the emerald to be at the top of inside the trees. Mm. So I want it. Here, here we go. Let's go ahead and start building these here trees here. I need leaves. I need leaves. Okay. <laughs> now, we're going to have to take a short break while we build these trees. Mm -hmm. Okay. Welcome back. We now have trees again, and we have an additional one. We now have Mihu here as well. Uh, hi there, flying hey, by. You to the rescue. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'll never. I'm never gonna say that name right. I'm gonna let you know that right now. Yeah, I know. <laughs> as far as I know, as far as I'm concerned, you are me. Me. You're me. Yeah. Uh, mainly because I like saying that. And you and I, and you and <laughs> was it, and you or I, and we are all together. No, you're <laughs> no, just you, me. You, me. <laughs> you, me. Okay, so we got the trees. Um, let me go ahead and I'll show you what one of these trees looks like by going over here and pasting the one that uh, I was just playing with and you can see the inside. Uh, we'll go right here. Cut into these two. Ah. Don't cut into bad those. Day, just just cut into this one. Okay, so this is the general tree. What you're going to basically see is when you go into here, you're going to get an emerald block right there. I may have made an improvement. And what did you do? <laughs> <laughs> what? Me, hey, you just put TNT down instead of a instead of a leaf block, and then quickly fixed it. I saw it. Oh, good. Let's <laughs> like not do that, because uh, that's uber cheating. <laughs> yeah, you don't want to hide TNT. Uh, no, no, I, I think, I we're, think there's going to be it. enough TNT flying know, around anyways. Okay. okay, so this is what the emerald block is going to look like. Now, the reason that <laughs> this is this there we go. Is good is, uh, not only is this worth ten points, but each one of these leaf blocks around it is worth a point. <laughs> So these are things you would like to aim for, because um, one tree is, um, well, that's a lot of blocks. You know what? I'm just kind of curious. Where's my TNT? With 10-point bonus in the, um, in the top. Let's go ahead and put that on my bar right there, and I need one of these, because we're going to go like this and like that. Not like that. No, not like that. <laughs> Fine. I knew go like you were gonna that. do it that way. It's like a flint and steel if you wanted. <laughs> now that's that. what, like, um, fifty a points lot. like that, like that, right there, easily. 
Now, of course, you're going to have to aim at that, and um, there's no guarantee that you're going to get that emerald block on that first shot. But, you know, it's it's something. It's also a bonus. It's pure bonus for the, the TNT bias stuff that goes wild and wonky. You get extra points. Yeah, it might also... I, I, I don't know what you guys are going to find is more, more beneficial. This is honestly an entire, <laughs> an ex entirely experimental. Now what? It doesn't work. You still haven't <laughs> noticed on best improvement. Oh, the 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 <laughs> portal block <laughs> randomly. The it's pretty window. It's beautiful. The one that's it's, it's a garage at... door. It doesn't belong on the garage door, but it is beautiful. That it's you can throw stuff through. Ooh. It's yeah. mesmerizing. <laughs> yeah. Put it back on. <sighs> okay. Uh, well, yeah. Take that. You gotta take that out because you can't blow. There. You can't blow it up. Yes, so you, you, can. you can't. Yes, you can. You can't. You can't blow yes, up a portal can. block. Yes, you can. You cannot. <laughs> Testing now. <laughs> oh, wait, 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 wait! No, this has not been copied. Do not, do not test on no, house. He's for, he's oh, moved yeah. away. Wait, now I can't even get one in my inventory because I can't type. Give one more to one. Hello. <laughs> Don't spam it. You can be dropping out of the here. world. Oh, actually, no. that with the glass of it. You know it helps if you take me out of cre creative. Because <laughs> I just rise, <laughs> rise again. I was just thinking, what's Pac doing underneath there? Apparently dropping on mass. Oh, mm. there we go. Okay, here we go. Don't change my game mode. <laughs> <laughs> he looks bad um, suspiciously. Wait, where'd it go? Oh, you can't place it. This is on a block. I forgot. Um, you do realize that you hey, where'd it go? Is taking Stop! <laughs> no. <laughs> there we go. Safe. Anyways, okay, now we're done killing Oddmast. I didn't even get to. <sighs> yeah, it glitched out the portal block, so. Yeah, you can't do it. The portal block just disappears. Yeah, so that's a no. <clears throat> Hi, Onmas. Welcome it's back. Really cute. I... For the few minutes. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> wow, I thought that was reserved for the honey play, but okay. He's <laughs> just pulling out all the stops. Uh, no. <laughs> <laughs> and one Onmas dropped out of the world. <laughs> you couldn't type it fast enough, could you, maybe? Yeah, I went down further that like time. It. <laughs> okay. All right. So that that's your first basic little test right there. You're gonna see, have, be destroying this little house, right? That is the first one, right? Or yeah. did we actually well, set an order? Whatever. We didn't set an order really. But <laughs> we haven't set an order. I've just kept it in the order of your initial document. Okay. What else do we have to figure out right now? Because uh, I think this is now adequate. Okay. Testing this is pretty the good pre actually. This is really good. So you're happy with the house? I think I'm happy with the house. Okay. We're gonna need to get a fresh copy paste. Uh, over by the the template. That would be a good idea. Yes. Before sure anything bad happens, like the beds inside. Uh, the next thing on the list was to test preliminary and the three challenges. But I think um, at this point, that's part of releasing the map, is so people can get in there. Pretty and, much. I mean, yes. we've, we've tested to see that the, all the things can work. So but, that's essentially done. Wait, me. No. Oh. Okay. Uh, we'll need to approve oh, the rules. Did you set really have to? We... It did blow it up, though. <laughs> it blew up the blocks around it, and then it got rid of it. It didn't actually blow it up. Are you guys still playing with the still... portal? Now, you do know you can't fill it with dirt because... Uh, there we go. Okay, you had to fill it with grass. I'm... All right, all right, all right. I know what I'm doing. Which reminds me, we're going to have to change... We're going to have to fix this with all the glowstone blocks randomly placed yeah. throughout the... Yeah, I'll clean it up yeah. in the morning I'll, or later tonight. I'll well, take we're going to have... I, not if Muncie Apple um, comes here first. Right. Right. Which is going to be interesting. All right, anyways. All right, what's the next thing on the list? Uh, approve rule set and make the Google Doc for judging scoring. We'll have to do that when you're not recording. Just go over very quickly some things that doesn't have to be right this second. Yes. Uh, determine advertising video stream time frames. Again, that's something we have to figure out. It doesn't have to be on your recording. That's true. Fix timers and the sounds below the timers. Can we just get rid of them entirely and let the refs just, you know, use 
a watch <laughs> or a timer in general. They can even put in the thing, you know. They'll be in the mumble rooms with the right. teams, so they'll be. It's not like they won't be aware of the timings and how things are going. So honestly, I I just assume we get rid of the timers and the sounds. But either that or we fix the timers and the sounds. It's your call. Mm. And if so, then hop to it. Somebody's <laughs> skill to me. He's got to get down there. I've been, I've been poking people yeah. for weeks to come to something. I, I don't. So. Okay, well, let's put it this way. If the timers are not functioning during the actual uh, match, then we'll just get rid of them. But we do have time in between now and then, and this is not part of what what is required. So... So you're gonna leave it for now. We'll play with it another day. If we're we don't, most we'll likely we're gonna have to destroy it if nobody help, if nobody gives us anything to to, to use for the timers. But if not, <coughs> I there's trying, another I'll moose try. room. <laughs> in, oh no! I'm telling you, I took care of every <clears throat> one of these things. It's over the sky. It's just randomly we're still getting moose rooms. Do not ask. It's just. It could just be that one block that maybe didn't get. There done. could be one block. I'll, I'll I'll have to go over it really really carefully but it's only in the 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 housing for the uber sheep so that's a clue that it's going to be in this spot so i guess we just make a bigger section sky yeah i got some right here okay so i'll have to make a bigger section sky the next thing uh again we have to determine the stream si uh times or i'm sorry the the preliminary times but you're going to do that off video uh, fix timers and sounds. Approve the winner's platform and the fireworks display. The fireworks display has not been made. Again, it takes better minds than mine. But <laughs> it's, no, it's, the platform. no, no, no. It's it's that at the moment I think you have to actually craft fireworks, right. which is actually a really horrible process because you have right. to get a fireworks fireworks and fireworks stars, and then you have to individually go through and make all the colors and all the different okay. types. Okay, well, then I can do well, some it's a sit. It's a sit-down. Assemble the charges, yeah. Yeah, that's all stuff that also yeah. does not need to be seen by them, and that's something that um, has nothing to do with testing, so... Okay, so we can just do grunt work with that on the side. Yep. Okay, if next. we want to do that. Plus, I don't want to show them the final pr platform because that's kind of a surprise right. thing, so yeah. But you did get to see it earlier, so you already have yep. your, yep. your stamp and I there. approved. It looks good. Okay, determining mm. the prizes are... Uh, I'm actually should go look. It's been slightly changed. Uh, determining the prizes, what? again, we can do that off um, well, camera. It, I could tell, tell one prize right you. now. The, the, the grand, one of the grand prizes that I know of, that, that I can guarantee that I can provide right now, is that um, whoever wins, I will um, go on to whichever server that they choose, and I will um, derp around with them for... Uh, Adequate amount of time. <laughs> <laughs> Very careful. We're gonna say praised, at dear. least an hour, po probably more in the range of a t two or three, where um, I can basically go on their server. It doesn't matter if it's um, a well-publicized server or if it's uh, you and like three friends, um, or nice. just nice. you. Um, you're gonna ha still have to tell me which <laughs> server to go to, and you might want to clear it with the admins. And there's no guarantee it's gonna be just me either, because. Um, well, I'm part of a pretty large group, so who knows? Right. All the people might show up with me because uh, it is the Minecraft tournament. So you never know. But I can tell you right now that is going to be one of the grand prizes. If if we provide any other prizes to go along with this, um, they could be they'll be more announced later on. But that's the one that I can guarantee right now. So fans of Pack Rat, ladies everywhere, there's a there's a prize on the line. <laughs> ladies <laughs> you, everywhere, okay. You get you get one to three hours of Pack Rat on a server if you're choosy. Doesn't it sound like one of those bachelor auction things? Okay. Well, yeah. Stop the video. Well, let, let me put this way: when we when we had the fan server, and on that note, when for the very <laughs> short period of time that we had the fan server running, the one of the first things that I did when I went on there is I rushed over to find a plot of land and built um, uh, Leaf Spleef immediately and just teleported people over there and we started playing for like two hours ju just uh, uh, and one of the good land games. Um, I would have no problems going onto someone else's server and building one of the good land games straight up and then we can have a blast and you could keep it obviously because it's um, the server your of your server. choice. So whatever I build you keep. Awesome. And that'd be kind of cool. So. Cool. You could even get autographs if you sign a book. If you sign a book, that's true. true. That is true because I just signed awesome. one for him. So, okay, so that's just one of the prizes. There's actually several others that we have been discussing. So, there you go. That's one for sure. And uh, of course, the last thing on our list is we do have to staff the dates once they're determined, and we do have to um, 
do the copy paste of the lanes. Oh, the thing that we're and gonna make yeah, the we're definitely gonna bigger. we're gonna end the the this with that because it's probably gonna crash the server doing that. Okay, um, the first thing when when he was, <laughs> she was talking about that, um, this lane is currently a thousand blocks long, and I want it to be three. So, yeah, Just three blocks long. That's... 3k long but yeah we'll go with <laughs> we'll go we'll go with that yeah whip out your axes boys yeah, we're gonna it's have to make to this go a lot longer years. now as far as dates go uh let's see if you guys are fine with this um mainly honey right, because she's life. the one that's gonna matter the most i'm thinking mm -hmm. that probably the best gotcha. date to do the prelim would probably be the 16th of february okay uh... It's either, <laughs> either the 16th or the 23rd. What do you guys think? Since you guys are actually here. Grabbing my calendar to tell you what I think. Yeah, See, I, for one thing, I'm not in college or school or anything like that, so I don't know if there's any form of date of any kind that's going to correlate with that that's bad. Like, I don't know if spring break's going on or, um, like, Groundhog no, Day or... Or March. Um, what, what? You were looking wait. at the 16th, you said? 16th or the 23rd. Uh, either either one's I'm good with me. Twenty third sounds a lot more preferable. <laughs> <laughs> What's wrong with the sixteenth? Um, and why did you choose pleasurable for the word of choice? What? what? Oh, oh, wait. I missed wait, what he wait, said wait, though. I said preferable. Oh, not preferable. Okay. Oh, yes. Um, what what we want to go with Oddmast's recommendation for the for the yeah. Why? Okay. Well, the twenty third? No. Why was sixteen? Why the sixteenth is bad? That's what I'm curious no about. Comment. Uh, because <laughs> because Maybe Odd Mast will be away, and since we need him as one of our judges or, or our refs to help, because he's one of the people that are guaranteed to sit there for twelve hours with me, um, <clears throat> right, dear? Yep. He needs to be available, and this and the twenty third is a much better day for him to be available. That sounds good with me. Okay, so you heard it, guys. Odd Mast says we're going to do the twenty third. It's <laughs> so it's going to last. A, it's going to be a little bit longer until we get to that, but we'll be so more to time that. for them to practice. More time to practice. Yeah. Now, okay. Now that's yeah. like I said. That's the twenty third, and I've always planned. I had always planned on having the actual tournament be two weeks from the time of the prelims to get to, so that's still pretty fresh. So that means that the actual competition will be on March 9th. Okay. That is the plan. All right. So, a word of advice for any teams: make sure those two dates. Yeah, that's the other thing. I didn't want to make it too close, so you guys have time have time to um, reserve that time for whatnot or other things. Mm -hmm. Okay, so whatnot and other things, indeed. Yeah, because it takes time to get time off. So, um, I know because I work mm -hmm. three jobs, and getting time off of one of them is interesting. Okay, time to do a copy paste, I guess, isn't it? Well, has somebody preserved our house build? You go ahead and do that. I'm going to go ahead okay. and start it's copying done. this thousand block thing. So our second lane needs to be... Oh, you're going to extend it. Right now you're just lengthening, yes? Uh, right now I'm doing the... Oh, wait, that's right. we got to lengthen first. What am I thinking? <sighs> All right. Um, I was going to, I mean, I was going to the, to the top of the last block. <laughs> Maybe I should... Yeah. A little bit more of the house in case TNT goes long. Well, it is the accuracy, so at a certain point, they're not, you know. Oh, as that's long true, as, as long get, as there's a lane. As long as you get the right. entire house, you're good. Because um, there will be a lane okay. there. What we're going to do is we're going to copy, pa copy paste the house uh -huh. onto the lane that <gasps> exists. So. Uh, right. And what I've been doing was copying from right about the, uh, the water line to about the edge of the glass panes now, but maybe I should go a little bit further just in case we get some well, the gla long yeah, the gla end of the ends. You want to get a little bit beyond the glass panes because that's not where the tree ends, but yeah. Pat, before, okay, you, sure. before you keep extending this, do we want to get the glass all the way down before you get all the And there is a warp to I the end, so you don't have I to I don't think I want to do it. the glass all the way down. Um, if, okay. if their shot is off that much, then they didn't get a good shot. Okay. Well, they're supposed the to be shooting straight. Know. There is a random chunk of meat here. Yes, I killed a gob of mushrooms last night. Ah. Another round of mass mushrooms. Oh, my. well, with that image in mind, I'm going to bed. So. <laughs> oh, uh, yeah, uh, mass is out. I assure you, they were delicious. And there's some leather. <laughs> <All right. clears throat> okay, you have a good one, Odd. 
He's already out, isn't he? But he was here for the important thing, so there we go. Okay, I think I'm at the yeah, I'm at the halfway point. You can warp to the end if you, are, are you going to try to grab the whole sucker at once? Uh huh. Oh, uh, if you warp in, uh, <laughs> I hear the hesitation in your voice. Uh. <laughs> Hey, no. End with a bang, I, I right? Confidence. Yeah. If you warp in lane, you get to the end of the of the thousand mark right away. End of lane. I believe it's just end lane. Like that warp end lane. I think is what he said. He made it. I just type warp okay. end land. That didn't do anything. That wasn't it. <laughs> end land. That was it, it is. It's in lane. I just did it myself. And I'm here. I just did it twice. Well, learn to spell. Oh. <laughs> I'm mean, sorry. <laughs> okay, I'm, I'm, I'm here now. Congratulations. I was about to say you can always TP to me, but I did it right. And a random white block here. And a <laughs> random block of bedrock missing all over the place. All that, the way that down. That would be your copy paste job to begin with. I didn't see that and just chuckled and left it to. <laughs> when you <laughs> first copy pasted it, it must have been screwed up. <laughs> Oops. Sorry. <laughs> I did notice that and I left it. I thought about fixing it, but I left it. <laughs> well, now we can't fix it. <laughs> It was good enough to copy paste the first time. It's good enough now. Okay, now I gotta go warp. You gotta recopy? Cause I'll fix it. And I gotta stand in one spot there so I can do the copy. Nah, he's already hopped over. Alright, I gotta stand. Oh, by the way, if you warp house, you'll be middle, you'll be right in front of Cheryl, basically. Right. So that'll save you some too. Mm -hmm. Here, the we've been sticking warps all over this server <laughs> because we've been all over. <laughs> we made a warp for the templates. Yeah. Um, we, so we've... you've got backup Cheryl and the house now under warp template. Okay. Oh yeah. Here we go. Warping all over the place. Utmost confidence. <laughs> I'm going the wrong direction, aren't I? I was about. This, I was about to stop was you. Yeah. You can have your F3 up. Isn't your F3 always up? You'll see the numbers climbing if you're going the right direction. Well, I noticed that I was Sorry. going in a direction that wasn't void. That was pretty much my clue <laughs> there. Mm. It, it, I do that, find that funny because, as you said, that my F3 was entirely up. <laughs> of course it is. It's always on. Okay. <laughs> Time to crash. No time to do a nice simple copy paste that is not going to kill the server. Ready? This is probably going to be the end of the video guys so <laughs> probably you Cross guys have a good fingers. one. Bye! <laughs> please don't please don't go away server please don't go away server please please please, please. Um, <laughs> I already did it. <laughs> oh wait wait wait. Don't don't wait. don't. Oh you're, you're one block off you didn't get the torches. <laughs> Oh, because you were you were trying not to get the uh, glass. <laughs>